Ken Lusaka ameongoza makundi ya kina mama katika uzinduzi wa manifesto ya wanawake wa kaunti ya Bungoma chini ya mwavuli wa shirika la Eco Network Africa akiahidi ushirikiano ili kuafikia malengo yao akihutubia makundi hayo naibu wa gavana Jennifer Mbatiani amewataka wadau wengine kushirikiana na serikali ya kaunti ya Bungoma ili kufanikisha manifesto hiyo kutokana na mgao finyu wa kaunti huku akiwataka wanawake kuwa mstari wa mbili katika kukabili ongezeko la mimba za utotoni kulingana na Lusaka manifesto hiyo imejitokeza wakati mwafaka haswa katika kipindi ambapo kaunti ya Bungoma inaongoza katika takwimu za dhuluma kwa wanawake na mimba za utotoni akisema kuwa ni sharti wadau washirikiane kutafuta suluhu ya janga hilo We have an assault on two fronts one is early pregnancy and the second one is gender based violence The statistics I was looking at, and when you get time to go through that manifesto, the statistics I was looking at are very scary. You look at Kandui, those are, we are talking about pregnancy, early pregnancies between 12 years and uh, between 10 to 14 years and 15 to 14 years. And those who are holding the title are Kandui constituents. Kandui is leading, followed closely by Mount Elgon. This is also very surprising. Followed very closely with Webuye West. Followed closely with Tongoreni. Sisi kama wamama tuna uzuni wakati tunasikia Bungoma county inaongoza kwa mambo ya mimba za mapema. If you are a mother, you know what it means. I know we have fathers, but the person who feels the pain more is a woman. In no wonder the Bible says, kwamba mtoto ambaye ni mbaya ni msigo wa nani? Wa mama. To appeal to all the leaders that it is possible for us to be in those leadership positions. And that can only happen if we hold each other's hand if we work together as women if we respect each other if we learn how to talk well about other our fellow leaders i want to assure you that we will go far